I became a chemist because I fell in love with the beauty, the intellectual beauty of the periodic table. And I'm quite concerned that future generations of chemists won't actually be able to explore the chemistry of some parts of the periodic table because we'll have made it unavailable. We're mismanaging our elements on a huge scale. Uh, in some of them on a global scale, we're disrupting the natural cycles of carbon, you know this, but also phosphorus and nitrogen we're starting to realise. Some of the more exotic parts of the periodic table don't have natural cycles. We're using them in, uh, in the technologies and uh, in, in a dispersive way. And the demand for these materials is starting to exceed the speed at which we can get them out of the ground. This is because there's a growing population, 7 billion now, 9 billion very soon, who all want higher standards of living. They all want the plasma TV lifestyle of the West. And we can't deny this to them. But we can manage those elements better, and chemistry is central to that solution. It has to be a cross-discipline approach, though, as we work to reduce the amount of material needed to, to deliver these same uh, technologies, to replace some of the at-risk materials, to recycle and have better methods for recycling these materials and create our own natural loops, and be able to make components that last longer so that we can reuse them. To do this, chemists have to engage with other disciplines, in different sectors. We need to work with designers, uh, architects, engineers, and NGOs, and we will find them receptive. I spend a lot of time in conferences listening to chemists telling each other how brilliant they are, but we need to get out and tell everyone else how we have the solutions. Another thing we need to do is teach our next generation of chemists about property and functionality rather than molecular structure. We're all trained to make white powders and clear oils, but customers don't buy that. Consumers buy functionality. And we need to think about how we can deliver that same function in a more efficient way. I'm Mike Pitts, I'm Sustainability Manager for Chemistry Innovation in the United Kingdom.